Ladies and gentlemen, welcome for the monthly news on Channel One. A sad month for the US is coming to an end. At the 8th March this year, our 27th president, William Howard Taft, died. A heart disease caused his death. Our current president, Herbert Hoover, took place on his funeral. He is the last run in president in the United States. The Supreme Court made clear that the actual law is too easy to manipulate. Moving on to the economies, the number of employed men in the United States is still not growing. Besides all these bad news, uh, some parts of the industry are even growing international. Henry Ford plans to build a factory in Germany. We are now switching to our correspondent, Alex Watson, live to India. Ladies and gentlemen, I am here in Dani, a village on the coast of the Arabian Sea. Here, the new campaign of Gandhi takes place. Gandhi's independence movement in India became a hot topic since the massacre of Amritsar, where nearly 400 people died. And here, Gandhi and his followers try to extract salt. With this, the Indians ignore the British law of salt extraction, which says that no Indian is allowed to produce or to sell salt. The police and the British government are using violence and imprisoning to stop the Indians. There are many wounded and there are over 50,000 people imprisoned. But there are still coming new people. The Indians still continue to extract the salt. The British government doesn't know what to do anymore. The question now is, how will this end? Will the Indian determination win or the British force? And with this, back to the studio. Thank you for that informative report, Alex, and goodbye everyone. Thank you for watching Channel One News.